wonder if the guy in the <laughs> convertible up front can hear me. I'm sure he probably can, eh? <laughs> just hears a biker behind him just yelling random stuff. McDonald's! Da -da 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 -da! <laughs> <laughs> it's so cold. It is so cold. My nose is runny. Yeah, well, that's bike life here. Ah, oh, welcome back, boys and girls, to another video or oh, vlog. I am. <laughs> I'm in the Royal National Park. I don't know exactly where I am. I'm not used to the area. I don't know names. I don't know suburbs as much. I came out here to just enjoy myself for a little bit, you know? But unfortunately, there's part of the road that has been closed, which is very, very disappointing. I want to know, see it. I don't know if there's any other way around, and I'm sure there is, but there's that little bit where it looks like the Great Ocean Road. And, uh, I really wanted to go there, but it's closed off, unfortunately. Yeah, it's a really nice place here. Right now, it is, it's slightly cold. For me, it is cold right now. I'm running my heated grips on maximum, and it's still not enough. We're on the Gold Coast, it will get cold early in the morning, and then it'll warm up to a nice, crisp, cool weather. And it's nice to ride in. But here, no, it's unforgiving. I don't know how you people put up with it here. I mean, like, I say, hey man, stay in your lane a little bit, sir. Yeah, I don't know how you put up with the weather up here. Or oh, down here, sorry. Yeah, I'll tell you what, I'm sure you guys aren't complaining as much. Yeah, you guys get some nice views from here, man. We don't really get any of this on the Gold Coast. Right on the cliff face, right by the water. No, nah. Alpha paintball. <laughs> I'll probably bring my real guns. I am not that nasty, I'm only joking, okay? But, for those people who don't call their hits, they will call their hits once I accidentally discharge one round. Look, he's gonna realize that he's gotta go straight. Yeah, it sucks, eh, man? Because that's the road that I wanted to go down on. But, yeah, it's closed. Yeah, that was a great meet. Oh, hope everything's all good. Med kit if necessary too in the bike. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> the low side? Low side. Low side, eh? I just, I know, I watched it. They're going out slow. Right. Yeah, well come on, it's been a while. <laughs> what did I go fast? I think you were the bull. Yeah, I think so. Afraid I was. Not too bad. A little bit there. <laughs> yeah, just a foot pedal. Foot brake needs a bit of a bend. And then you're pretty much sweet. Yeah. Well, that's Is that good. you or someone else? I... Bass plate on the hook, maybe? Maybe. No, uh, that's... Yeah, that's probably someone else. I thought it was from under there. Oh, wow. Well. Yeah. That's a low bot. Alright, thank you for the help. All good. No scratches, no nothing. Yeah. No. Alright. Yeah, I literally just rolled off it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, these things happen. Yeah. Alright. That's why I got my thing under there. Yeah. Alright. Yeah. You used to take care, right? Safe, eh? Yeah, always. Thanks, Wes. See you, bud. And here's the tricky part is pushing that off. <laughs> oh, 
always good to look out for other people because they will do the same for you. I guarantee it, a lot of riders will do the exact same for you. Yeah, so I saw that KDM up there turn around for a second. I was just like, what is he doing there? And then, yeah, like, as soon as someone turns around mid-corner or someone just does the unusual, a lot of the times you do realise that something was going to happen. Something has happened, sorry. Because, you know, like, riders, if riders do things unexpectedly, there's, there's a reason for it. Yeah, I figured that some might have gone down. And unfortunately, they did. So, just take it nice and slow. See what the area is up ahead. But apart from that, yeah, these things happen. Especially in that specific corner, I had a feeling, but yeah, it turns out it was true. Gotta look after yourself. Good thing she's wearing a gear. Good on you. See, people like that who come prepared, those are the good riders. Yeah, so it must have just been a little bit of a low slide, uh, uh, low side. Low slide? Possibly grab the brakes, I don't know, there's a number of variables. You know, these things happen, cold tires, you, you name it, 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 there's always something to it. Main thing is, is that the rider is okay. I'm not gonna lie, I did feel sort of useless there, but like I said, I'm there to help if necessary. So, even if you guys are just standing around, you know, don't worry about it. If we if we need you, they need. Well, if they need you, they need you. If they don't need you, then just make sure that they're okay before you leave. I've been to a few crashes. Some were good, some were bad. Yeah, you just learn from it. That bike's been there. I hope the riders down there somewhere. But. Taking photos. <laughs> That's where he was. Jeez, okay. I would knee drag, but no, no, thank you. So just give him the, the good old peace sign here, yeah, man. I hope I find that thing somewhere, you know. If you guys are from Sydney and you know who takes photos here, if you guys happen to find that photo, can you please send it to me? I would absolutely love to have that photo. So, hey, little pasties. <laughs> Bloody full tuck, man. They're going full tuck around them vents. Oh, jeez. Hey, these roads are so gorgeous. Every time I come here, this is I think this is like the fourth time I've been here. It's always beautiful. It's Jurassic Park beautiful. Holy bloody crap, it's a dinosaur. Jesus Christ, what the hell? No, we don't get to monetize for that. Yeah. That's all you get from the cyclist. <laughs> oh, look at this, man. This is a gorgeous spot. Look at that. It is so rainforesty here. Oh, man. My English is so off, but I don't care. I do not care. I am enjoying myself. But yeah, sorry. Let's get back to it. Those two subscribers, Papa Rides and Ducati Rider. Yeah, thanks for again for offering me for a little bit thanks again for offering me to tag along for one of your group rides i do like riding by myself quite a lot i get to do my own thing stop where i want do what i need to do and um yeah as much as i like group rides like i don't mind them i don't mind them they're not bad it's a wee bit hard to explain but still i don't know it just wasn't i guess like, i guess you could say i just wasn't in the mood at the time but i will do something before i leave sydney all right i might actually just host a group ride just like a couple weeks or months before I leave Sydney. How about that? If you guys highly suggest I should do a group ride down here in Sydney, I don't know where, so I might even get one of you guys to do it, host it for me, or take me on a road that I don't know, that which is nice, twisty, straight, I don't care really. For it, preferably twisties. Should I do it or should I not? I don't know. If I knew this area is well enough, I'd probably host my own group ride. Let me know in the comments below if you want me to do like a little bit of a group ride. You know, grab my subscribers, grab whoever you guys want and just go for a little ride somewhere. I'll get to hang out with you for a day. How's that sound? Or you guys get to hang out with me, I don't know. But I'm pretty much going to be hanging out with you because I don't know where I'm going. I am hopeless when it comes to here. On the Gold Coast, I can go wherever and I know where I'm going. Yeah, I can get lost by making just a simple right turn. That's how useless I am. I won't be leading the pack, someone else would be. I don't know who, even if it's a uh, group ride with another group. Um, doesn't bother me. I would at least like to hang out with you, with you subscribers here in Sydney. Whilst I can, because I'm here anyway, so. Oh man, 
is it like I don't mean to be rude to cyclists but is it necessary to take up like two lanes now, if a car came around the corner the wrong way you know a high rate of speed I think don't you want to be like in a single file just in case you know so it's just like when I take corners up at uh, Queensland Beach Fond, for example right I usually don't run wide when I'm entering a corner I usually stick to the middle of the road just in case a car comes around the corner and actually crosses the line and I need the extra space Matazil did pick up on this but I actually couldn't give him a straight answer on why I did it until it took me a while just to kind of click and then I still haven't explained it to him yet so yeah Matazil if you're still watching this like I know my lines are a little bit off to you especially when you're behind me but yeah the thing is I do actually take my lines a little bit off into the center as I'm entering the corner only because I'm trying to create myself oh sorry I forgot to wave oh, I got yeah I forgot to give you a bit of a head nod I'm just trying to create a bit of a buffer from people who actually try and cross the line as I'm entering the corner so there you go now you know why my lines are really really crap but it is for a good reason yeah boys and girls man this ride is so enjoyable I love it and it's not as twisty as it is up in Queensland only because this is the only road that I know but it's still enough just to make me happy I wish there were twisty roads that I knew of down here in Sydney but it's still enough I'm happy I don't mind but I still wish they were twistier you know <laughs> answer me this all right I'm also curious as well when you see another rider and you give them a head nod and they don't head nod your back do you, do you, what, how do you feel? Because I feel like I'm, I feel left out a little bit. <laughs> I know I'm being a little bit of a wuss, but I feel like I'm being left out, you know. It's just like, you know, you give them the good old nod, you can give the biker the good old bike wave and stuff. Do you feel left out when they don't give you one back? Oh, sometimes I do. There we go, another nod. <laughs> and another one. Got one there. I don't know, if I miss it, I miss it. I'm sorry, like, I can understand, but... I still sort of feel left out. I know I'm being a big baby right now. Yeah, let me know how you feel. I I, I want to know if I'm I'm not I'm not the weird one here. He was smiling. He was doing a creepy smile. Okay, cyclists are now creepy to me. Oh my god. And uh, I can't even see over the shrub line. Even if I stood up to try to give you guys a good view. I can't see the seat. Oh, 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 there's a little bit of break. No, that's all you get. Oh, no. Cyclist. Cyclist. I don't mind being on the road. Yes, we share the road, but I don't know the rules down here in Sydney, but I would like them to just try and stay in a single file as much as possible. You know, I can understand just them doing their thing, but seriously... But if it's legal here, it's legal, I won't complain. But seriously, good day, good day. That looks like police bike, good day, good day. You know, courtesy of the other drivers. I could understand if there's debris, nails, other sharp objects or hazards on the side of the road. But you know, come on, keep the flow of traffic going. So yeah, I don't hate cyclists, it's just some things where I just kind of go, can you just please move over? And just just a tiny bit someone did make up a good point if cyclists are going to use a road like other road vehicles are doing why don't they pay for registration you know is that a fair comment is that a fair comment so yeah again let me know about that down below should cyclists be paying for registration so they can legally use a road as other roads users do road uses i can't english why what is what is wrong with me Ugh, my butt's starting to get sore now because I got a backpack behind me, another ZX14. He, he gave me the nod first. How nice was he? Very nice, very nice. I love you. I love you, ZX14 rider. So, fellas, cancel, cancel. Yes, thank you, Cena. much the only fun I can get just right there <laughs> no I wasn't even hanging off the bike Go on. 
I'm not going fast, so I'll let him through. One thing I don't like doing is crossing the double solid lines. That to me is a big no no. No no, don't cross it there. This is the the no no line. No no, don't cross it there. This is the no no line. What's up, riders? What's up? I wonder if the guy in the <laughs> Convertible up front can hear me. I'm sure he probably can, eh? <laughs> just hears a biker behind him just yelling random stuff. I am somehow touched in the head. Even my mates think that. You guys and girls don't know, I was actually dropped when I was a baby from literally a three story balcony. I survived. I can literally say I was dropped when I was a baby. <laughs> I don't even know why I'm laughing at that. I nearly died. But still. <laughs> Oh gosh, I am touched in the head. Uh, uh. Uh. Yeah, let's not risk it for this one. Not risk it for the biscuit, because I don't know these turns too well. I wish I could just take pieces of the scenery here from the Royal National Park. Some of the views are so good, man. I'd love to take the cliff face with the road and just plop it, plop it like yeet it right into the Gold Coast somewhere where it can just be beautiful for a ride. Yeet! Yeah, can you guys or girls tell me what is with this booth? Last time I stopped here, you know, I just I followed everyone. I just stopped, but I saw a, uh, bikers go around the booth. Like, what is that booth really for? I'm like, how, what do I do? Like, they just pretty much just said, oh, you're riding through, and I was like, yeah, okay, yeah. Yeah, I'm actually just riding through. I'm like, I know if you stop something, you probably need a ticket or something. I don't know exactly what it is there. Can you tell me exactly what I need to do there next time I come back? In case the booth is actually open. All right, for anyone who knows. I don't want to accidentally go past the toll booth or whatever and not pay for it. Make <laughs> sure you know, whoop, whoop. Whoa, whoa, look at that, that was a Ducati V4S, I believe. I've only ever seen one. That's the very first one I've seen. Why did I say I've only, I've only seen one? Because that is the only one that I've seen. What the hell? I'm not gonna lie, it looks pretty cool in person. On pictures, yeah, it looks cool. But in person, obviously, everything looks good in person. Can you agree with that? I agree with that by far. Go on, kid, you got it. You got it. You pull that wheelie bin. Oh, McDonald's. Da 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 da! Oh. <laughs> Kids in the back of that, Merc. Come on, let's go, let's go! Yeah, it's just a little bit of a vlog. I don't know. I, I wasn't really planning on vlogging again today. And I just wanted to enjoy myself. It's the first time since I've been down here to actually go ride at the Royal National Park for a while. So, yeah. It's a wee bit of a drop. Let's not go over the rails with this one, eh, guys and girls? Uh, get it? Get it? <laughs> I'm so bad with jokes. What's up? Mr. Fireblade Man! Man! Walter Grove And then he waddled away Waddle waddle To the very next day ba, 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 ba. And I, good on them I think they're picking up rubbish Good on them It's just the little rocks or the little ripples Are those people who are trying to change the world Those are the people you've got to look out for People look down on them But those are the people who are actually trying to make a difference And if they are, yeah And if they're the ones that are cleaning up rubbish around the park More power to you So I'm actually going to sign off here boys and girls So I hope you guys and girls are hoping to have a fantastic week, day, month, year I right, just hope you're having a fantastic everything alright If you guys aren't having a fantastic everything Try to enjoy the little things in life alright Guys and girls stay safe, take care and I'll see you on the next one Peace
This is the the no no line. No no, don't cross it there. This is the no no line.